Now, when Uncle Henry came to Britain and set up that car plant in Dagenham to start building cars, well, Ford from almost day one was one of Britain's most popular models. And even today, all the old Fords seem to have entered the classic stakes. There's more one-make clubs about Ford than any other make in the business. This is the somewhat bulbous Ford Prefect. It was the deluxe version, if you like, of the famous Ford Pop. But if you think this was ugly, just you wait. Of course, styling in 1954 was very different from today, but uh, even so, you can't forgive the console a great deal. Um, my uncle had one, though, and uh, used to take us down to Somerset regularly with no problem at all. This one has a period accessory. This sun visor is something that enthusiasts will kill for. Ford, of course, an American company, and who could doubt the American origins of the styling on the Mark III Zodiac? Wonderful fins to die for. <laughs> Oh, memories. I remember spinning one of these round Hyde Park on a wet Thursday night. This one has a wonderful interior. It's been beautifully retrimmed and all for two and a half thousand quid. Of course, if the top of the range Zodiac is too strong for you, why not go for the economy version, the Zephyr 6? This guy's added portholes on the side and that's not all. He's put a Perkins diesel engine under the bonnet. So you get the style of the Zephyr with superb diesel economy.